Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. I'm back with another video. And this one I wanted to talk about, I just remembered today, and um, it was with a student. He was a science student, and I think he's into evolution, and he explained everything through science as well. And one of the objectives of this kind of people is to deny that the existence of God. So he talked to me about how everything is originates from an atom everything that's 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 what he kept on coming to and as i was driving and i said to him look so you believe everything about this car is from atom you and me everything sun universe he said yes i said okay imagine this car now that i parked and i stopped and i took the bonnet and i left it on uh, f uh, on the road in front of me and i took all the engines out and i placed it in front of the that that bonnet and then i took the wheels i put them on the side I took the doors and I put it on the side and I took the boot, took it on the side, everything I just like put it on the floor, all spread out on the floor. And all of this is atom. He goes, yes. I said, okay, bring it together. And he had no answer for me. So, so studying the Quran, you know, there's a verse in Surah Al-Baqarah, it's 164, where Allah talks about the creation of the heaven and the earth and the alteration of the night and the day. You know, he goes into the ship that sails through the ocean. He talks about the rain that descends from the sky by which he gives to life to an earth that was dead. The beasts scattered all around the earth. And this is the sign for those that are wise. So in Quran, you know, sometimes it raises a question here and it answers it further down there. And because of this understanding, I was able to ask him that question to which he didn't have a reply. And what was the answer? The answer was in everything behind everything, there is a cause. What is that cause? What caused it to happen? And that's something that science, they, don't, they can't explain. And obviously that is Allah. So um, I hope um, this was helpful for you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.